You thieves and scoundrels, one and all! Boy on you and your false war! Uh oh! Oh no! Oh no! Nice! <laughs> Look at his face, just says it all. Oh god. Follow Lee to ambush products patrol. Okay. Really? Unhand him, Edward. You again. Let us go. And John Pitcairn with us. <laughs> I will not have my authority challenged. Ooh. I. Poor peacock. Put them all in chains. Uh oh. <laughs> oh hell. What? Prevent snitches from calling reinforcements? I didn't even see that as an objective. Oh, what the? That was pretty cool. What the hell? Ow! Whoa, hey there. Hey, buddy. Okay, really? Okay, okay, I'm gonna do some defending here. Really? Alright, 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 alright. That's better. That's better. Okay, that got him. Jeez. Snitches. I didn't even see that as an objective until it was too late. Well, like I said, there's plenty of room for replays. Smoke bombs? It's a weapon wheel. Do I not have the ability to use those or something? Or do I? Huh. Alright, where the heck... Oh, there he is. <laughs> He's like, don't kill me! Don't kill me! And just take the money off of these guys. I'm not too proud to loot. Stiff upper lip, British gentleman. But I'll, I'll take their stuff too while I'm at it. <laughs> oh, Mr. Braddock, you are a toast. I stay my hand today because you were once my brother and a better man than this. We should our path ever cross again. All deaths will be forgotten. You're free now, John. Oh, excuse me. Goodness, that was rude. Traitor! Go on, then. Join them on their fool's errand. <laughs> and when you find yourself lying I assume broken, you've good reason for causing all this madness. I can't... <laughs> he just disappears into the background. He <laughs> disappears into the background. <laughs> we just ignore him. I love it. That's hilarious. You don't even get to listen to his monologue. It's just like, uh, we don't even care enough about you. New email received. Who's sending me emails? Yeah. 150, huh? Ah, not bad. Huh. Alright. Map. Okay, I got lots of view. Oh, look at all the viewpoints. Huh. I kind of feel like I want to take the time to go visit all of these, just because. Oh, I see. New invention recipe unlocked. Okay. Interesting. Trying to see what I'm supposed to do here. Let's do a little more exploring. Gotta synchronize some viewpoints.
Although I just realized, just thinking all this may not be very interesting to everybody watching this. But you know what? That's fine. I'll do this. Apparently this, you can fast travel again. Yeah, I was reading something about how you can fast travel efficiently. Why did I... Oh, really? That was... Oh! Tree climbing. So, this dude can climb trees just as well as Connor will be able to later. I find that rather interesting. But whatever. It's fine. Oh, oh, that dumbass. Alright, up, up, up. Oh, okay, so... E to jump. Okay, so you can just leap over the obstacles. I haven't been to this one yet, have I? I guess not. Oh! Oh no! Oh god damn it! <sighs> oh god! <laughs> what happened to the you won't jump off of... What happened to that thing that that, that, uh, that Rebecca said about the animus? It won't make you jump off of things as much anymore? I guess that isn't entirely... <laughs> I'm just gonna look everywhere. No one's gonna notice me. And there is my... Leap of Faith! Smash. Now, what is this? Is a mission of some sort? Open door. Sorry! Didn't mean to do that. Oh, is this... Oh, is this the, uh... Oh, this is the dude that, Oh, this is the shopkeeper. Oh, okay. I got it. What do you need, mein Freund? Mein Freund? Is this German? Consumables. Cartridge. Smoke bombs. Two plus one <laughs> equals three. <laughs> really? Really? I never would have figured that out. That's awesome. Ooh, I can buy more... Oh, haha. <laughs> huh. Hmm. So, normal sword. Oh, I see. That tells me what... Okay, so s slower speed, higher, better combo, better damage. I see. Wait a minute. What? That costs less, and it's better? Hmm. My goodness. So apparently, some of these upgrades are... Okay, so the worse the weapon the more it costs. I see. Uh, somebody's going to have to explain that one to me. Alright, whatever. <laughs> uh, who's this? Oh, hi, Ben. That's Ben. Hello again. <laughs> almanac pages. Well, not quite. It's a treatise, actually. Oh? <laughs> Concerning what? The benefits of taking an older woman as a lover. Huh? Well, really? was that like the <laughs> you, you little Randy boy? First and most obvious. Oh, this is this is worth listening to. Oh my and God! So this makes for far more stimulating conversation. Stim I'm sure. Makes other things more stimulating as well. But more on that in a moment. Oh my God! All right. Your argument for experience makes some sense. Second, when beauty fades, women must improve their utility. Lest, Lest they be, be discarded and, and forgotten. Oh, there is an old woman who oh, is not also kind, compassionate, and good. That's something of a generalization. But also true. Wait, are you warming not your hands by the, the fire that's not actually lit? Cannot conceive. Which means one less thing over which to fret. <laughs> In fact, you also increase the chance of acquiring something like the French pox. Its presence clearly visible, or the woman dead. She bet. One desire a child? Then make a young woman your wife. Let the older one be a mistress. Oh, I love and it. And that brings me to my fourth point. With age comes prudence. An older woman is less likely to reveal your indiscretions. My goodness. Yes. I suppose you I know. suppose you know quite a bit about that. <laughs> oh, I'm and proud of it, thank you. As to the fifth reason. Because in every animal that walks upright, the deficiency of the fluids that fill the muscles appears first in the highest part. The face first grows lank and wrinkled. Oh, I see where you're going with this, then. And the rest and arms. 
the lower parts continuing to the last as plump as ever, so that covering all above with a basket and regarding only what is below the girdle, it is impossible of two oh my God. grown old from a young one. You are such a you are and such a lech. In the dark, all cats are gray. The pleasure of corporal enjoyment with an old woman is at least equal and frequently superior. Every knack being by practice capable of improvement. Oh my lord! You mad bastard! Well, <laughs> it's true, and believe me, I should know. I oh, this is so great! Many. You should try one as well. Like a fine wine, they this is so fantastic. Although I suppose if left unattended too long. Oh my so God! He's going on and on and on, and on doesn't that, he? That, my friend, is a most unpleasant experience. Better to work in a field oh often plowed. You know. Hurricane of euphemisms. Is there more? Indeed. Oh my God! Indeed. The sixth is this, this is fantastic, but, but long. Is to take a <laughs> is a great responsibility. Mishandled, it can oh. ruin lives. No such risk with an older woman, and this implies the seventh. Younger women are more given to compunction. Anxiety and unease are not present in the more aged. Dude, this guy's really thought this out. And as to the last of my reasons, well, it's really quite simple. Older women are, are so, so very, very grateful, grateful for, for the attention. attention. You make a compelling argument, Mr. Franklin. Oh my God. I might just have to run a This is too funny. Myself. I highly recommend it. This is so funny. Oh my God, Ben. I owe you a great thanks, by the way. What for? Speaking with me. You see, I have very few friends in Boston these days. Is he just going to go on and on? Do to earn their ire. Started with a cartoon I drew, suggesting unification. How else can we hope to withstand the French, French menace? French menace. That's a good question. I proposed something similar at the Albany conference as well, and it ruffled quite a few feathers. See, I've begun to wonder if Parliament best serves our interests. That's a good point, Ben. The colonies might be better off independent than autonomous. Most of my peers, however, haven't. No, I imagine they wouldn't. The suggestion. Are things truly so bad under the crown? But you've answered your own question. Under why? Under it should be side by side. Does France reside beneath Britain? Do the Italians, the Prussians, the Spanish? This could last no. forever. Sure, they may disagree from time to time, even come to blows, but they stand on equal ground, and we should as well. Are the colonies not simply an extension of the kingdom, though? Another borough, if you will? No, we are not. We've evolved into something else, something distinct. Hmm. I suppose and it's only can... natural to desire parity. We leave behind our parents, our childhoods, our homes. Little breaks in immersion like that, like the fire not being on. He's warming himself in front of it. If it's true for a person, why not a nation? Awfully open-minded there, yes, my friend. Yes, exactly. Hmm. Interesting. Then again, he's an assassin. He's kind of supposed anyway, to be. Anyway, I've taken up enough of your time. Please, don't let me keep you from your work. <laughs> All right. Fascinating conversation, Mr. Franklin. All right, what have we got here? Any more waypoint? Any more? Okay, so blah 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 blah. Inter oh, interactive conversation. I like that. What is this? Vigilantes. Okay, those are the guys that can help me when I get in. Doop -a doop -a doo. Okay, a little bit more. Just a little bit more here. Matter of fact, at some point I may just cut out big chunks of me running around getting viewpoints. Just to save everyone the, the time and trouble of watching it. If I put 30 hours into this game and 30 hours is... is uh, that's... oh my god, that's... It's like... 150 episodes? That's... no. 100 if I make them 15 minutes? You know, if I want to make this game similar, if I want to make the gameplay here similar to what I'm used to, I should probably map space the jump bar to mouse 4. But I'll deal with it.